people that read all the books and the people that write the books that are the experts, the experts of the world make $79,000. You don't need more books. If, if books solved all these problems, librarians would be billionaires. PhDs would be billionaires. Those are the people with all the books. Most of these books are a procrastination device that... Stefano says, hello, Derek. Thank you for taking the time to give us uh, the wise words. I uh, hope you had a good day. I have a question about psychology. Uh, I know you know a lot about people and the way they behave and why they behave the way they do. Are there any books? Get the fuck out of here. What? If, if books... See, th this is the, the sad misstep that smart people make. They think all the answers are in a fucking book somewhere. Uh, what? Why, are, why is it that librarians who are surrounded by books are not the billionaires of the world? You ever heard of a billionaire librarian? I never heard of one. I never heard of a billionaire librarian. Next, you know, why, why is it that PhDs, why are they not the billionaires of the world? They read a lot of books, right? They read a lot of, hey, they even wrote the books. They even wrote a lot of books. So they read a lot of books, they wrote a lot of books, what does a PhD make? Jack shit compared to your real potential. A PhD makes nothing compared to your potential. 100 and some thousand, 200,000, ooh, 200,000. 200,000 is a great salary for your PhD. 200,000 is a very good salary for PhD. What does a normal PhD show to make? A PhD in a random topic. Let's find out. Let's find out. Let's, let's get a Google search in there. Any case, don't stop this. As soon as I hear, I mean, I'll read the rest of your question, but as soon as I hear, the, oh, the answer is in a book somewhere, go do something instead. Go do it. Show, show up to a live event where you're in a room with you know, a, a hundred other people that are serious. Show up and be with people that are making moves and taking action. Uh, go through the course and actually do every bit of homework. You don't, even, you don't even have time to read another book. You go through these three courses, then you go through them again as an observer. You don't have time to read another book. I included some books in the courses that I thought are useful. That's 30 something books over the, or you go through the three courses, it's over 30 books, 32 books maybe. You don't have time to read another fucking book. What do we got for a salary? Uh, it varies wildly, but uh, the highest is 79,000 in the state of Washington. For what, a fucking doctorate degree? $79,000? PhD, yeah. $79,000 with a doctorate degree. Wow. Wow. All right, so yeah, and, and I have a bias when I'm thinking they're making, you know, 150,000, 200,000. Those are people that are, have business-related PhDs that are, yeah, they're economics and finance and things like that. $79,000. So the people that read all the books, make this note, Stefano. The people that read all the books and the people that write the books that are the experts, the experts of the world, make $79,000. You don't need more books. You don't need more books. If, if books solved all these problems, librarians would be billionaires. PhDs would be billionaires. Those are the people with all the books. Most of these books are a procrastination device that I gave you 30 fucking books to read. Read those 30 fucking books. Read those 30 books, all right? I'm not against reading books. I got a bookcase right behind me. I got another bookcase right there. I got plenty of books. I got plenty of other books. They're not on these two bookcases. I'm not against it, but the, this fantasy shit of like, oh, the, I'll just read a book and then I'll understand human psychology. No, you won't. No, you won't. You'll just be lying to yourself and you'll make worse decisions. I wish it was that easy. Some people are confused. that would say, Derek, Derek, what is the Ten Commandments of Wealth? Not the Ten Maybes of Wealth. It's the Ten Core Things that you're going to need to know about in detail if you'd like to accumulate significant wealth in your lifetime. Click this link up here to find more information of exactly what is the Ten Commandments Wealth, how is the program structured, what's inside of it, how are you going to benefit from it. If you're doing well already and you'd like to do better, click that link and find out more. There's over 100 hours of content in this program. I've interviewed dozens, dozens of world champions that shared what it took for them to win, to be the top, top, top Hall of Fame athletes in their respective areas. And I brought a lot of other superstars in there from business, from legal, people that are real world entrepreneurs and made serious money as I have myself. We all share with you what are the foundations you're gonna need to know if you wanna be successful yourself. Be a chooser, not a loser. Click that link, find out more. I'll see you inside.